Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy, Big Mike, and today, today is Monday, June the 12th, baby, game five tonight, LeBron James, Cavs won the other day, you know what, Cavs set some records, whoop, you had Kyrie, Uncle Drew doing his thing, you know, Kyrie Irving, was dogging LeBron James. Boo! Oh, not only was he, not only was he slamming the ball, not only was he slam dunk, you know, doing his thing. LeBron ooping out off the backboard. Boo! Bam, baby! Bam! LeBron, you're a monster. You're, you're, oh my God. You're going to win the championship. Guys, three, one. Look at that, three, one. This is 2017. Calling for a repeat. Yep, game five tonight. Around Wednesday will be game six. About Friday, be game seven. Be over. Yep. Telling you what, I can't believe it, but the Cavs set some records. The Cavs. Dominated the Cavs. Whether you agree or not, you can leave it in the comments down below who you think is going to win the championship and why. Because your boy Big Mike already knows. LBJ all the way, Uncle Drew. And if I had to run my five, tonight's game five. At nine o'clock, yep, nine o'clock, son. Hope y'all tune in and watch it. Here's my five. If I had to pick my start five for the Cavs, forget the Warriors. They, you already know, they overstaffed with Steph Curry, Kai. They got Steph Curry, Clay, KD. We ain't worried about the Warriors. They overstaffed. And their bench overpower too. We already know for Cavs to win game five tonight. LeBron is going to have to come off the bench. LeBron's going to get like 30, 30 seconds. Or a minute. Sit on the bench. That's all he's going to get. Because LeBron is a dog he is a monster he is wait I, I i can't give that to him lebron is not clutch no when it comes to clutch situation oh Kyrie! whoa <laughs> steph curry in your eye last year Three ball, wet like water. Wet like water. Yeah, Kyrie did it last year for the championship. And I hate to say it, I think it's going to be Kevin Love or Kyle Corver this year. Going to stroke a three. Game six, bring it home the title. Cavs, I hope and pray that you fight, fight. Fight. Do not give up. You are down, but you are not out. I wish I was your coach because I would push you to the limit. I would run you till your guts come out. And then I would say, get up, pick your guts up, and run some more. Oh, oh, uh, coach, I got a puke. Hold up. Wait a minute. I can't run them. Shut up. You do it. Hey, I need a water break. Oh, go pass out somewhere. I don't care. It's championship time. It's game time. It's turn up time. It's time to start.
playing. Ball. Balling out is not for the faint of heart. Balling. Ball so hard. Ball like Mike. And when I say like Mike, I'm not talking about your boy Big Mike and LeBron. I already know they. I already know that they think that you might be better than Michael Jordan. It ain't going to happen. You ain't better than Michael Jordan, Bron Bron. I'm sorry. You a dog, but you ain't a monster. You got the takeover kind of power, but I hate to tell you, sometimes you ain't clutch and you, sometimes you just ain't got a jump shot, boy. <laughs> no, I'm shooting it straight with you. But getting back to what I was saying earlier, kind of got off the subject, talking about Brian Bond, Kyrie, who's bringing home the title, talked about <laughs> last year when Uncle Drew splashed a three and Supposed to be the best three-point shooter on the lead right now, you know. Oh, Curry! Oh, Curry! Flicks it, Curry! Curry! Curry didn't win a championship in 2016. He probably ain't doing it in 17. No, he ain't doing it in 17. I'm just saying, you know. So right here's what's going to happen. I done gave y'all a rundown of what's happening, what's going to happen. And that's a 10 out of 10 chance. 100% faith in it that that's going to happen. And I hope y'all like and subscribe my video. And getting back on the subject, my five for Cavs, if I was coach, would be, I would have J.R. Smith running the point. I would have Kyrie at the two because, you know, Kyrie's a monster. He could shoot the way he was driving game four. He would just drive in, laid up off the backboard over three defenders. What a, he just, he, my aunt's a beast, dude. You, you know, you already know. But I'm saying, so we got J.R. Smith at the one, Kyrie at the two, Bron Bron at the three, you know, LeBron James at the three. Would have to go with Kyle Corver at the four. I would have him out on wings, on each wing, guarding the per like the perimeter on the court, and shooting on the wings, each side of the wings on the court. For five, I would probably have to go with Kevin Love because that guy, game three was a monster, offensive boards. He's turned up a lot, guys. And Tristan Thompson, why you even play him for, Cavs? He would get no minutes with me. Oh, Kevin Love would be like my down low guy. How it is. But that's my five, guys. JR, Kyrie, LeBron. Then you got, like I said, Kyle Corver on Wings. Fifth, Kevin Love. Because JR Smith, if you do not watch game four, almost hit a half court shot. Had two guys on him. <laughs> Smack! Wet like water. Smacks it on net. Fade away over two guys. He was, I don't know, I had to be some, I ain't going to say luck because J.R. Smith's been doing his thing. He's been, he wanting that ring. And actually, I don't want to see KD win a ring. I don't want to see KD do his thing. You already know Curry doing his thing. Clay Thompson doing his thing. 
And if the Warriors would let Andre Iguodala do his thing, he can do his thing, do his thing. But too much of talking about Warriors. Steph Curry, I ain't saying you trash, but nothing against you, boy. Nothing against you either, Clay Thompson or Steph Curry. I just don't want to see KD bring home a ring. Don't want to see him win a ring. Not with the Warriors. Stop respecting him after he left OKC. You know. I can't do it with OKC, so... You know, why don't I go do it with Golden State Warriors? I might win a ring. Yeah. I might get a championship. Yeah. I might be on an overstacked team. Yeah. No. Come on, man. I didn't really respect LeBron James. He left Cleveland. Everybody burns his jersey. A few years back. But Bron Bron had heart. LeBron James, a lot of people can say a lot about him, but he came back. And won a championship. He won it. But you know, when he first come back in 2015, it's when he made his return. Gotta give it to you. Steph Curry, you was doing your thing. You bring home a championship that year. You don't know why you brought home a championship that year? I'm about to tell you. Your boy Big Mike's about to tell you. Why you brought a championship home that year? Why you brought a championship home is because Kyrie Irving got hurt on the Cavs. And LeBron was trying to do it all himself. He had hardly no help. And we already know what happened in 2016. Kyrie comes back that season, dominates LeBron and Kyrie. Kyrie snaps three in your face, Curry, to steal your title from you. Down 3-1 in 2016, 2017, down 3-1 again. And I hate to say it, I see the comeback happening. So, let's get it. It's your boy, Big Mike 2K, and I'm out. Peace!